Hey there guys, Skippy here from Skippy6Gaming coming to you from Tutorial Land and today I'm going to try not to be too far away. We are doing a slime block elevator, that's it right there straight ahead and it just goes up and up and up pretty quick too. Very cheap on resources, I know it looks expensive, uh, it is actually not too expensive. Furnaces are just cobblestone so uh, at the end of the day you can make this very affordably. I added the glass and the redstone lamps, I'm not going to show you how to put those in the tutorial, it's pretty simple, I just put them up the side, put the redstone lamps next to the pressure plated uh, thing so if someone in the distance is going up you'll see light 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 all the way up so it's pretty simple the way this one works is you just walk forward and there you go simple and plain simple and easy just press forward and you could go up pretty quick looks pretty exciting I really like it so on that note guys I'm gonna show you what you need we're going to go ahead and make this bad boy right about now, I guess. Uh, the easy way to work this one is just to make a water drop down on the other side, and then you pretty much can have yourself a super high base mob grinder or anything. Uh, let me get the stuff, and we're going to make a video. For this build, you're going to need 10 redstone dust, 5 redstone repeaters, 15 blocks of choice for the redstone circuits, 4 sticky pistons, 4 slime blocks, 4 pressure plates, and about a stack of furnaces. Guys, it's just cobblestone. Get over it. Of course, it's just 3 levels high. If you want a higher one, you're going to need a few more items, so, so let's you've get got it. everything you need. We are here in the tutorial world. Let's make it hmm over here so dig yourself out a space that is a three by three and too deep what is going on with my video put a sticky piston in the back like this then put a repeater going into the piston put it on four ticks delay skip the corner four ticks delay into the corner drop some redstone dust in there then let's go ahead redstone dust in there block of choice up in the top right there redstone dust and redstone dust seems easy let's keep on going slime block right here first you got to get rid of those guys on the side so they don't get stuck and put furnaces there you could replace the furnaces with obsidian if you really wanted to uh, and let's put another one here I kind of want them to face the right direction so as you can see it looks pretty legit to me and I think right at this point in time we're going to place the last one right there uh, looks pretty straightforward it only gets better from here what the heck there you go easy enough pressure plate on that block hits the trigger makes the slime block go up the delays make it take a second fill in the floor Okay, so grab your furnaces. You're going to need a lot of them. And then start piling up. Extra two on this guy. Extra two on that guy right there. Extra two right there. Looks good, looks good. Go in. There you go. Perfect. So now what we're going to do is start up our second level. Place a block right here. We're just using this as a holder to get us up to where we need to go. Two blocks easy put a furnace and here we go with the placement very similar to the ground we're gonna be using a kind of couple placeholder blocks here at some point in time uh, let's put this sticky piston facing up right behind that furnace and then we're gonna go ahead and put a slime block right there perfect looking good looking good and now we're gonna have to build up our kind of uh, furnace furnace rim for if for lack of a better word and try to get them all the face inside if possible I like the way that looks looks good to me there's a lot of placement and unplacement but this is a pretty cool build for survival it's not that expensive slime blocks are the only expensive thing and furnaces are just cobble so I don't think they're that bad throw a furnace in here Perfect. Get rid of these guys. And furnace, furnace, furnace. And back up. Looks good. Looks flush to me if you ask me. Looks shiny. Get rid of that guy. And move on forward. So grab yourself your pressure plate. Put it right on top of that furnace. 
And then grab yourself uh, blocks of choice, I think. No, yeah, let's do it. Put one right there and one out right there. So you'll see two blocks, two blocks. Diagonal with the piston and the furnace. Grab yourself a repeater. Throw your repeater into the piston. Four ticks delay. And then take a repeater out of this piston. Four ticks delay. And then get some dust and connect it. As you can see, we've kind of kind of come to the point where it's pretty much gonna get you up the first two levels yep yep and there you go looks like it's working that's the whole gist of it you're gonna move up one block at a time moving forward and then all you got to do for this right here is uh replicate each layer one by one so as you're gonna see right here we're gonna end up putting uh furnace nope not like that uh we're gonna put two blocks one two then we're gonna put a furnace Go up in the back area here, sticky piston, one down from the furnace, facing up with a slime block on there. Looks good. Do the same thing we did last time where we put our placeholder blocks in the wrong ones. Horrible. <laughs> Holy cow. And get rid of this guy here. Put a furnace. This side here. Put a furnace. This side here. Put a furnace. No. Yeah, boy. There we go. More furnaces. This one's wrong on... Oh, my. Ah, we'll leave him there. That's fine. <laughs> Let's go ahead and throw a pressure plate on this furnace here. And get rid of these guys. And we have another layer. I think we'll do one more. Uh, let's go. Yeah, get those for now. This. Okay, so get rid of that guy. I'm trying to make a trim look, look a little cooler. Uh, we got everything we need there, so let's try her. One, two. Oh, well, that kind of worked there, so let's let's get this. Uh, let's keep on going. Uh, we're gonna need to put this guy here, just a placehold for the actual two. So you'll see that what we do right here is actually place these, just like these ones there, with the same diagonal. So let's go ahead and put that row there. And that guy there perfect and then bring it out by one so it's two on each one repeater four ticks into there into that sticky piston repeater four ticks oh going around put this redstone down and it goes let's get some fern eye fern eye right here no we gotta fix it yeah put that guy there that guy there put one guy over here there you go looks good and nope two blocks and then we're gonna get this guy here sticky piston red uh, slime block and then furnaces all around you guys getting the you guys are getting the picture again pretty easy on survival um, it takes a long time to crouch place but you know bigger problems in the world uh, it's pretty resource friendly when it comes down to a bunch of cobble few repeaters uh, some slime blocks those can be hard sometimes I guess but let's put this guy here 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 another one another one another one and we're going to put a pressure plate right there let's go ahead and get the power system on the side ready to go right there right there get rid of that guy two blocks from the furnace two blocks put in a repeater one two three four Repeater, one, two, three, four. Dust. No, you know what? Look what I did. I put this repeater in. So make sure the repeaters are always coming out of the furnace. Yeah, see? Repeaters are coming out of the furnace and into the piston. Just like I did it on the first one, but I did it wrong on the second one. So as you can see, we're working good. You guys get it. Get rid of that guy. We're going to want it to go looks good make sure it looks the same always you know each level is the same so let's go ahead and put this repeater here four ticks and redstone dust on the sides as well as a four tick repeater into the sticky piston nice there you go working through problems every day and getting on up let's see what else we got going here looks good there's a pretty handy little uh farm you know I'm, or not farm uh, elevator i might use it to get up but the, the problem is it most likely wouldn't be the best elevator to get up to like level 180 or something because 
you're going to end up moving forward like a block every four blocks or throw these uh, furnaces on here. Looks good. It works. Perfect. One more furnace. Oh boy. Get up here. Crouch place. Oh, for the win. So now we're just going to go up and make a floor, I think, right now. I'll get it. I'll get it. Perfect. And then we're going to make the floor right there. Sounds good to me. Get this guy out. Get a little floor going. Perfect. Nice little slime block elevator. My first one that I made a tutorial for. So I like it. It's pretty resource friendly. It looks cool, you know. I think uh, you could do all kinds of little add ons. Uh, let's go. Let's, let's do a little bouncing. I think we should do a little bouncing. Let's go. No, oh, you know what? I don't know if I should have took those blocks out. Look at that. Let's put those guys back in. We don't want to be uh, messing it up. I was just trying to be a coolie. Trying to... Oh. <laughs> it's so much fun. See what happened there is I pressed away from straight. You're supposed to only be pressing forward. <laughs> and I keep pressing a different side. But there we go. All the way to the top for the wind. Yay. And there you go, guys. That's a slime block elevator. Pretty easy. Pretty straightforward. If you like this video, don't forget to smash that, this like and share that video on social media with your friends. It's the best way to help my channel grow. Thanks a lot for tuning in, guys. I hope to see you with another video uh, coming out tomorrow. And uh, yeah, love it, guys. Catch you on the next one.